Well, he's one of the more accomplished strikers in this division. Sprawl and brawl, whatever you want to say, he's going to try to keep this fight standing tonight. It does not matter how he accomplishes it. All he wants to do is be on his feet and at range, hitting you with a beautiful jab, staying away from the grappling exchanges. You don't accomplish all the things that this man has accomplished over the course of his career without understanding distance. He has great distance management, which then in turn allows him to land all these beautiful diverse kicks, spinning back kick, jumping high kick, so many things he possesses that he will try to use tonight in this fight. Yeah, if this turns into a kickboxing match tonight, most it's people over. believe, yeah, his opponent is in a it's world over, of trouble. All right, so here he is, one of the more prolific takedown artists in the UFC at present. And when you get some praise from Daniel Cormier, when it comes to your offensive takedown game, you know you're doing something right. If we talk about wrestlers and judo players and grapplers, but this guy just combines all of that. He is able to use foot suits from the grappling game. He is able to use throws from judo, and he's able to use wrestling in the, from the wrestling game to take people down. He has an array of takedowns at his disposal, and he uses every single one of them. From the speed of the level change to the timing to the knowledge of where to go next when the guy starts to defend, he's truly, truly something special. I don't think he can take you down, but tonight he doesn't have to, so. He So two truly elite strikers here. We sat down with them on Thursday and asked them, any thoughts of taking this fight to the ground? They want to strike. They want to strike. That's what got them to the show. That is the path that they are normally on. And tonight they get someone that allows them to fight in their comfort zone. They don't have to worry about defending takedowns. All they have to worry about is who can rely on their knowledge in the striking to carry them to victory. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? He blocks the punch. Oh, combination lands, and it seemed like almost every strike found the target. He's so accurate when he decides to attack. It is a sight to behold. Nice kick. And both guys really throwing with authority. Got clipped with the right hand. Oh, he lands a huge knee to the body. Knee to the body. Look at how we... Oh! at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Won't finish his fight. Oh, how about it? Huge kick landed. That one landed clean. Stuffs the takedown when he hip tosses no him to the mat. Now we'll see what he can do from here, DC. Right into side control. He's gonna try to control him, then find a submission. All right, he's trying to control posture here. Now trying to hip escape. He's just trying to move out of this position off the bottom. All right, well, both fighters pretty comfortable on the ground, DC, but you got to be very careful hanging out here for too long if you're his opponent. Back to the feet now. Switching stances here. Tried to go to the body, but unable to connect. Try to establish that jab. Oh, big left hand there. How about that chin? Again, he's looking for that left. It's not there. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Beautiful body kick. Oh, big punch land. All right, he engages in the single collar tie. Man, he is so sound defensively. Nice job to raise the guard there. It's the relaxation that allows him to see things coming and block most of the strikes that are coming at him. 
Oh, big knee to the body. How do you get that one? Just unable to quite find that range. Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown deal? Oh! Huge right hand! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, just misses with the kick. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are gonna take their toll as this fight goes up. Slips. Went for the inside leg kick. Great right hand, no good. All right, he closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. And here he is back in familiar territory in the clinch. Game of inches right there, Damn. boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. All right, so a huge round for him there. That head kick probably would have had me out for good. I survives to see another round. Yeah, but he'll go back to that. It landed so perfectly. He set it up great. He did a great job of mixing up the target early, going up high, and getting the desired result. Second round underway. And he connects there, DC. Great job landing that punch. Hook is there again. Oh, big roundhouse attempt just misses. And he counters with a left hand. Trying to establish that jab once again. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Over and over, he lands a big body kick. Left hand punches the Back and forth we go! Nice combination of strikes there in terms of the accuracy. I mean, that's exactly what a coach is looking for. That's exactly. It's like the guy is hitting ash. It's like he's hitting focus mitts, but instead, he's dancing all over his opponent's face. Man, is he timing his shots well here tonight, DC. It's hard to recall him being this accurate in the past. I mean, he is so sharp. And not only is he accurate, he's also keeping very busy. Oh, stuffs the takedown without issue. Beautiful strike. Oh, he lands a huge right hand. That is, oh man, this dude is good. Ooh, looking to go to the leg kick here, just out of range. Big shots being landed on both sides here. Continuing to work the body to great effect. And he caught the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. And they separate. Another shot here. Oh! He was hurt. He was hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Oh, he might be out. And now he lands a combination. Takedown defense holds up. Big knee to the body! And now he's got that tie clinch. We'll see what he can do with it. Beautiful kick. 
Well, he has landed some good shots, DC, but really unable to string anything together in terms of solid combinations. It's because he's not committing to it fully. He throws his jab. He may flow the right hand out there, but he's not really sitting down on the right. Oh! He's in trouble. Whoa! He's hurt bad. Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. series of punches by him there. He has certainly had no trouble finding the range to him. He is finding the target with everything he throws. He's mixing it up beautifully. Well, he has really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive than we saw in round one. And now starting to find himself in the pocket. That was a good. Nice strike. Hard shots landing on both sides here. He's wearing it now, bleeding from his cheek. Strong outside leg kick. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. And he continues to work the body here. Look at him drive his shin into his own body with that body kick. Big powerful punch lands. Now he gets back to range. 20 seconds now remain in the round. When you're in the clinch, you can pull down on the head and land these beautiful punches to the head. Wind it up on the right there to no avail. And a nice job at least staying upright on that. All right, so a high-level round there for him. We'll show you some of the action here, and you got to think the knockdown is going to be featured prominently here. Thought he might have had him out of there. He thought he had him, but the guy's tough. The guy's durable. He has a fantastic chin. But he just needs to stay the course. He does not need to be discouraged. Think about this. You're winning, and you're winning going away. That was just a moment. Keep going in the same direction, and you will get the finish that you want so bad. You ready? Third round underway. Yes, they heard him in the last round. Same exact one. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Planted and fired there. Landed to the body. And man, these guys are throwing back and forth. Just missed with the leg kick. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge block. Well, just as he did the previous round, he continues to connect on a high volume of strikes. And a good sign, too, doesn't seem to be slowing down whatsoever. Big body kick. that kick. Big head kick! Oh, he missed with that right hand. Whoa! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish his fight. Oh, he might be out. You got him. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. Oh, big roundhouse attempt just misses. That could have been lights out. And they separate. 
big head kick. Well, he is really starting to apply a lot of pressure here down the stretch. Not as much offense earlier in the fight. He is making up for lost time now. Liver kick. Nice punch lands over the top. Got the single collar tie. And they sit. Oh. Wow. Stuffs that takedown attempt without issue. And now he's got the tie clinch. Good part. All right, so he connects with another punch. That one appeared to stun him. He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. No! Oh, my God! Big right hook coming. It's blocked. Just missing on the high kick there. Looked like it did stun him a little bit. Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. about the speed on that reversal there. I mean, I know you can get out of some bad spots, but not with that type of speed. You cannot allow him to get leverage on the bottom. What a sweep. Well, anytime you are in a ground fighting situation with this fighter, you're potentially playing with fire. Side control now. All right, he's very comfortable fighting off his back, DC. Now looks like he's trying to hip escape. Yeah, he's trying to hip escape or maybe look for a Kimura here. Oh, worked hard to get up again, but he looks like he's compromised. Oh, he's back up again. You gotta like that. He's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Back to his patented kicks here, but just out of range. Oh, he continues to land a high number of strikes in this round. Really hasn't let up when it comes to his aggressiveness. Certainly have to be mindful that you don't gas out, but you gotta like the output on display here. Yeah, he kick. He's hurt, he's hurt. Wow, that right punch has been the money weapon for him tonight, and he landed it again there. If his opponent does not change something, he will continue to throw the strikes until he makes it. Stop throwing it. And that'll do it, 15 minutes in the books. All right, so let us now check out some of the action in that round, DC. There was a whole lot of it, including a stunner upstairs that nearly closed the show. It was a lot of action. It was back and forth action, but the big moment was that big strike to the head that landed, that put him on wobbly legs, and in survival mode, luckily he made it to the end of that round. Oh, well done to block that powerful kick to the bottom. Nice kick. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here to... Oh! He's hurt. Oh! He's hurt bad. He's out! Take a look back at the highlights. You know we're going to find that nasty head kick somewhere in this highlight rip. Just an incredible result for him here tonight. A very nice head kick to finish the fight, but don't ignore all the work he did with his head.